Hey everyone, Nicola Light here, remembering you back into your own light. I hope you are all well, all well, all well. I wanted to come on and share some information with you. Did you just see that orb go past? Um, on some information that I just brought forward for Patreon and my members um, video, which was all about, um, this is some of my scribbling and ranting, and it was some information that was within there that I want to share with you guys, which is about the new year of 2024, which is an eight year, because if you add up a two a two and a four it, it equals eight but i want to go into the symbolism of eight from my perspective of being okay if you're new to my channel please check out all the details below there's a referral link to light language um, course on udemy there's two on there. there's a transmission one which is amazing has helped so many people and also an activation to understanding light language course so go check that out as a referral link as i just said and if you do want to work with me one-to-one -one, get to know who you are, where your origins are from, if you've got divine couplings coming up and you want some a guidance within that, I have an awful lot of understanding of it. So have a little check out of my website, which is nicolalight.com. So without further ado, I'm going to just rub this out. But before I do, I'm just going to go into a little bit of information within it. It was talking about the space continuum. Um, do check out that video and join me on Patreon and on my membership if you want the full video content. But what we was talking about was the information of the cycle. And within a cycle, there are cycles upon cycles upon cycles. And if you can see here, everything is within a box. And if you would have watched my videos, all the information that I'm getting at and through if my inner wisdom coming forward is brought forward with light codes that are remembrance light codes. And the information that was coming forward was that everything is within a box, but there is a sense of circles within circles within circles, which when we look along a starting point of a journey and an ending of a journey within a space time continuum, we are having cycle, circles within circles within circles. So within this construct, we have a sense of flow within a box which is form which is the experience this is not really coming forward very very well in this now moment but I'm going to deepen into it now let me just go back in because I'm going back over old ground so if you do want to take this information as I said please go and check that out so okay let me just take this out of the equation rubby rubby rub see look it's just Release, release, clear. <laughs> okay, let me just bring in the information then. So 2024 is the year. So 2 plus 2 and 4 equals 8. Okay, done. Okay, let's get into this particular subject. But I'll probably bring that information in about the time continuum of experience within experience perception of reality which is the box concept okay da. and so we're going to leave the x out of the, the zero out okay da. But this is actually quite relevant. Zero da. This is experience. So everything is contained within an experience. So if we have zero and we have eight within it, da. It has a point of center which is the crossover point. And the reality that we live in is dualistic. We have a sense of good and bad. Black and white. Duality. Okay. But the importance of this, this point of focus, our dot within, and the experience of left and right, up and down and all of that, duality, duality, gives us an understanding of who we truly are as we allow ourselves to enter into this mode of experience. You can see that the infinity symbol is actually an eight. The eight year is that of either balance from the center of self or experience of extremes. So this year of 2024, it's either extreme 
polarity or it is centered. And to get to the place of centre, you need to see both polarities of experience, but you focus here. Okay, you focus in the centre. An eight year is the wanting for neutrality, balance, harmony. You focus on your inner inner strength of being, your, your centred point of experience from your sensory perception being balanced, this year will be amazing. If you're looking at good, bad, up, down, left, right, that's what you're going to get. You're going to get an amplification of this or that. Neither good, neither, neither bad, okay? We're going to get that sense of, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, or oh my God, oh my God. Same thing, negative and positive experiences. There is a full force of energy around us that is taking us through the observational focal point process to enable us to move into a greater knowing of who we are. This is the central point. This in our body state is inside of us, just below the heart. It's the solar plexus. Okay, the solar plexus houses or just above it, if we want to be overly particular, but it's around about this sort of area just underneath the heart to here, where we hold our sense of power. It is a crossover point of the lower body and the upper body. So the upper body and the lower body. For us to focus upon the energy center of the heart, we drop down even further into an embodied state of the center line, the movement into the centering of the field. So we bring the central column of light of information down through and flowing through us. This is really very small, so it's, but it, it brings the energy down through the central column of light to flow through us. But the cutoff point from the upper world and the lower world of experience is coming into the center point. Just like an infinity symbol, you're crossing over from the lower body to the upper body to the lower body to the upper body. But your focus is always inside of yourself. You're not looking outside into reality or the other side of reality. The focal point is within. This year will enable you to intensify into the understanding of who you truly are and a greater uh, soul growth experience. You can toodle along all you wish, but if when you focus upon the inner strength of who you are, you can create from there, manifest from there, bring forward the prosperity, wealth of information, wisdom, inner light growth emanates from the point of centre. So the point of center here emulates out and out and out and out, and it moves you into a greater knowing of the whole reality of this construct completely that frees you from restrictions of your mind. So your mind is here and your mind is here. This is where you are embodying the experience. This is where we need to anchor it into the body with identifying of who we are. So not only from a central point, we are also observing who we are and we're embodying the energy into the reality also. So we bring in the, the, the flow energy into a sense of reality, which is the box, okay? So we've got a box within a box, within a box, within a box, within a box. And this reality is then sitting within circles, within circles and intermingling with circles and boxes and creating all senses of um, sense of um, uh, geometric patterning, shaping uh, cycles, patterns, repetition of cycles to learn our soul growth and learning. 
to bring in the prosperity code of life, of being in our flow state, being in our original template of being. It is not the distortion of the illusion, just like the water, um, they're showing me the water um, significance when you look at water and you praise it or you or you don't it changes it morphs it changes so we can morph and change with the reality that we are emanating from the 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 prosperity code of experiences coming from the center of light the codex of light sits with inside of yourself that you ignite within that spark within that god source mother father god source Christos, whatever you want to put a label to it, ignites inside of yourself and starts to expand into the greater knowing of who you truly are. It is the expansion. It is all that you are. It is an empowered state because it comes from inside of you. It is that. It is that. It is that. It is that. So these are remembrance codes for you to switch on and spark the inner wisdom. Thank you. Please take these in with your breath. Feel these codes trickling down your spine. Thank you. Thank you. So let the body start to move that energy down the spine. You might want to start to wiggle it in. It's this movement of, of this energy that moves through the spine, an infinity symbol that moves down and clears and cleanses any distortion that is inside of you. It is the figure eight, it is the year of the eight. It is the great uprising of humanity. But there is also the deconstruction of humanity. Either focus on the centre and be all that you are, or you can focus within duality of, oh, this is really good. Yes, indeed. Experience, experience, experience. We need also to embody. So when we embody we bring it down into physicality. This is our ether. This is who we are, the spark within. And this is the experience of duality as we move into creating and reigniting ourselves into a positive mindset on the earth and to uprise and allow others to to jump upon our flow of life and to bring forward their own spark and ignition from within so that they not focus in upon all the bad things that are happening in this world at the moment. And yet some of us also go into this state and that is beautiful too, that experience. So we have a choice of left to right, up and down, in and out, but it is always coming from the centre point of being, okay? <laughs> that's a bit of channeled information coming through there also from higher self um and and then hopefully those codes will um, no those codes will ignite whether you're conscious of it or not whether it's tucked in your subconscious mind or whether you brought it forward and you felt some ignition with inside of yourself be empowered don't let anyone be the guru you are your own internal guru you sit upon your own mountain with inside of yourself and you learn and you grow and you expand into the greater knowing of who you truly are i'm so excited for all of us that sit upon this land it is time for our rise is it not so breathe these codes in, breathe this energy in that I am portraying and sending out with a sense of guidance for your ignition. You may take it, you may think me mad. It really doesn't matter to me. What matters to me is that I see my own growth and I let my cup overflow. And if you take it to receive it, so be it. Come join me as we all rise together. No hierarchy here. See your own light and rise. Ooh, ooh. So ooh, I do hope that that's quite exciting for this year of understanding that 2024 is a transformative year for many of us. But we must focus within the centre point of being. OK, thank you so much for joining me here on Nicola Light channel on YouTube and um, 
I do hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful beginning and new beginnings are all coming in. So I'm going to leave it there because I'm starting to rant and rave. As I said in the beginning, if you want to check in with that other video, that um, that there is a link that is there for you. I think it's this side on the screen and you just go in, click it in. There's Patreon um, and also membership. So hmm, tier two and up, I think it is. Yeah. Like and subscribe. Please comment also. It helps with the analytics and gets me seen. And this information then can get out to others. Please share it also if there's somebody that you feel would resonate with it. Okay. Take care, everyone. See you all soon. Bye.